I'm really excited about bringing uh, Between the World and Me, the stage adaptation to Atlanta. Uh, it will be one of the most moving and meaningful cultural experience that anyone can have. And I'm grateful that I have the support of all of you guys, as well as the city of Atlanta, to really amplify and make this a really, really special moment for all of us. Between the World and Me is, is, a, is a cultural must have. You know, I think it's one of those things that uh, uh, when you're given the opportunity, if you haven't read the book, but if you're given the opportunity to experience it live on stage through the eyes and, and, and energies of, of the directors and producers and the artists and the, and the music, um, this, is, this is one of those must-sees. So consider this a cultural gift. It's not just that Between the World and Me is a number one New York Times bestseller or that it won a National Book Award. But for me, it's personal. I grew up in Baltimore, and I understand every nuance of that book. But so does everyone else in Atlanta, in Harlem, in Chicago. We can all relate in a visceral way. And so in a metro of millions, knowing that we only have 3,600 seats between the two shows, it's a must-see that people go, especially our young men and our fathers and I hope they do. Thank you all for what you're doing. This is an opportunity for the young men of Black Man Lab to experience this incredible artistic literary journey. And it's important because it will affirm what they live and experience in their own black bodies. And so we're hopeful that people will just donate $40 for at least one student to attend and to receive a book and to have this experience of Between the World and Me. So we appreciate you all. Thank you for what you all are doing to bring this cultural moment to our city and to these young men who need this and deserve it. So on October 22nd at 3 p.m., you can experience Between the World and Me and the stage adaptation at the Atlanta Symphony Hall. We hope you would support our young people by just donating $40 so that they can not only have this book in their libraries, but they can also experience this cultural moment.